All right, guys, so unfortunately the boat ran out of gas, so I've got to swim us back to shore. I'm going as fast as I can, guys. Alright, what up everybody? It's me, Red Guy. Today we are going to be going out on the gorgeous lake today. And I didn't know that it was that clear. The lake is pretty clear. And this place is awesome. Today we have tons of fun. And last night I didn't get Red that Eye. good of sleep. Are you going to try to tell him why you didn't but get good sleep? Because guess what he did this morning, you guys? He got up early and got drone footage of the sunrise. Five o'clock. Check it out. How sick was that sunrise? It's gorgeous. I it's know. full of pink, orange, and rye guy. My man got up early to watch that with his buddy Austin. That was so cool. Thank you, Austin, it for providing fun. us that footage. I was too tired. I fell asleep editing the vlog last night, so I missed the sunrise, but thankfully, Austin got up, got that with rye guy, and we can include that in the vlog. But now, we gotta pack up, we gotta get out there on the lake, and rye guy, are you gonna try surfing, wakeboarding, anything today? Probably tubing. Some sick tubing. Let's get out there. Let's go. All right, guys, we're loading everything out to the beach. Oh my gosh, Brandon's trying to show off his muscles. We've got kids right here carrying coolers, more kids up there carrying coolers. Pull Pulling wagons whenever you're taking 28 people to the beach. There's a few things to bring. <laughs> there are a ton of things to bring. Everyone's got armfuls, but it's gonna be a great day on the lake. Super excited. Brexton wants to try kneeboarding. A little cloudier Crew today. Crew wants to try wakeboarding. Nice. Gonna be a lot of fun. Guys. Hey, I was gonna say, check me out, but then I was also gonna say, Oh my gosh. Something that's cool about the place where we come for this beach is that it's got a gigantic park. If the kids get tired of the lake, look at that park. That is a legit park. I have found Brandon over there a few times. Yeah. Those just just swinging. Very inviting. <laughs> Do you want help? Okay, we're probably gonna be heading back in by the time you get there. <laughs> I help you. I'll help you. Okay. Good girl, you're doing awesome. This is all of our group, you guys. It takes a village to get us to get set up on a beach, having a great time. It's kind of awesome the staying in the house, everyone just hanging out, talking. The kids are playing so well. It's been so much fun. I'm so excited for today on the lake. It's a little overcast today, probably not as sunny as yesterday, but it's still gonna be so fun. All right, you guys, first sesh of the day, Saturday. We got the double knee boarders going out here. We got Austin, we got Cody. We're gonna send them out here. Guys, we got a packed house in this boat. Packed house. 17 people, did we count? 13 people, how are we at? 16 people. We are at max capacity, but that's because we're having max fun out here on Bear Lake right now. We had one round of aqua-based fun. We're back at the shore now having some lunch. Everybody's snacking it up. Claire, you having fun out here today? Yes. What do you got to eat? Kit Kats. Oh, Kit Kats. Well, that's just the lunch of champions right there. So we've had some Kit Kats, we've had some Uncrustables, we've got some good food, but I think it's time to get back out there on the lake. I know Cody, my main man, wants to go hit the wakeboard. Austin wants to do some surfing. Kirby Doo got a brand new fishing pole for his birthday, which by the way is tomorrow. If you guys are watching this, that means it's today as you're watching it, so wish Kirby a happy birthday in the comments. But Kirby Doo got a fishing pole for his birthday, and he's gonna break it out for the first time, doing some fishing, and thankfully, we got some friends who have fishing supplies in their truck, so they got some weights and some hooks and some other things like that. They're gonna get them all set up, see if we can go catch a big fish out here in Bear Lake. I think that's why they call it Bear Lake, because the fish are the size of bears, dude. I think that's what it is. Smile. All right, you guys, this place continues to be awesome. This trip continues to be epic. It's getting hotter, sunnier. As you can see, I am roasted everywhere, covered in sunscreen, so don't worry. I am trying to take care of myself as best I can. We're gonna get back out on the lake. We've had a ton of fun out here on the beach. It's time to get back in that crystal clear blue water and bring you some sick drone footage. I think it's time for that.
it. Woo! Bear Lake, I never knew you were this beautiful. Woo! Hey, buddy. I got me and my boys out here. Got Brexy Doodle, Kirby Dooby Doo. We're gonna do a nice extra slow tube ride. We can do some savage tricks, like standing up and surfing, switching places, maybe jumping off the back and hanging onto the back. What do you guys think? Should we do it? Yeah. You guys ready for this? Yeah. Let's go. Wait a minute, guys. Who's facing the wrong way, me or you? You. <laughs> I'm in the fun zone, baby. Whoa, Kirby's a fun zone. <laughs> Guys, so unfortunately the boat ran out of gas, so I've got to swim us back to shore. I'm going as fast as I can, guys. Woo! Bear Lake, baby. Oh crap! <laughs> Guys, we just walked onto the beach. Our tents are all over the ground. These nice people right here helped us and said that they were bent in half and all of our stuff is blown everywhere. So we have quite the mess to clean up. You might wonder sometimes why Bear Lake isn't a little more popular. It does get very choppy, gets very windy, and this is the result of that. We were gone, all of our stuff blown over, chairs blown over, tent shades crumpled up, blown down the beach. Thankfully, people picked it up, tried to put it in one pile for us. But this is the wind, kind of keeps this place from being more popular than it is. Uh. So obviously, the night is over. We came from the lake, came home, wound down just a little bit, had some dinner and then we decided it would be a good idea to go get shakes in Bear Lake on a Saturday night. Not a good idea people. It is the most oh, yeah. insane thing you will ever see. There are lines at every single place an hour deep. We passed four shake shops. Of course the famous LeBeau's had the longest line. There's two of them. We stopped at one across the street because it seemed like it had the shortest line. By shortest line I mean it took us an hour and 20 minutes to get shakes for the family. A long time. But I took my rag guy with me. He kept me company. We got to hang out. Brought him back here for the family. So now the family's having shakes at 11 o'clock at night, people. It's vacation. We need to get into bed. <laughs> More importantly, I've got to get editing this vlog, you guys. So we've got to sign this thing off. We've had so much fun today. The lake was gorgeous. It was perfect weather. We just had a blast today. You guys, it was awesome. I just finished making a cake for Mr. Kirby. Tomorrow is his birthday. So you guys, down below in the comments, wish Crew a happy birthday because it's a special one for him. We're He's so excited to be celebrating him tomorrow. It's great so. to be eight, people. We it's are so great stoked. To be eight. I feel kind of bad because honestly, his birthday is going to be packing up, heading home. We do have a few things in mind a few things we're gonna try and do to make it what special a fun for him we've been able to have, but we've been able to have a riot through the whole weekend just it happens that on his birthday is the day we got to head home but we're gonna still make it awesome so come back tomorrow make sure you wish him a happy birthday we're gonna talk to you guys tomorrow we'll see you bye bye, -bye.